If you are a freelancer wanting to outgrow your activity and turn it into a long-term sustainable business, you might just be the one who needs to hear this today. So I hope that this will help you as it has helped many others exactly like you in the past. But before I start, let me tell you that we all go through difficult times and it's how we react in these exact moments which makes the difference between those who hide and those who shine. I want to share with you some of the key points to keep in mind and apply so that you can stay motivated when your business hits a rough patch and we all go through these moments at some point. So first assess the situation. You need to figure out exactly what the problem is and why it is happening. And I say this because most of the time problems are not what they seem to be. You need to learn to read between the lines of a situation and understand what exactly is going on and not act on what it appears to be. This will help you to come up with a plan to address it. And second, is that plan of action that you need to create? Develop a timeline and goals, achievements that you want to put in place so that you can get your business back on track. And it is easier said than done. But once you have clarity, I mean absolute clarity about where you want to be, the rest is a breeze. Third, focus on the positives. Remind yourselves precisely why you started this business and look back at all the successes that you've already achieved. And keep in mind that whatever happens to you brings you closer to achieving your long term goals. And it's one step at a time so keep going. Fourth, talk to mentors and peers. Get advice from those who've already been there, who have gone through a similar situation to what you are going through right now. And they will know how it feels. They will understand exactly how you feel. And they will be able to guide you in how to deal with the situation because they've done it themselves. Fifth, break down your tasks. Identify small achievable goals that will help you move forward. Don't try and do everything in one go. Define the order in which each of these tasks need to be done and prioritize so that you are in control of your progress. Number six, take care of yourself. Make sure that you get enough rest, eat a balanced diet and take breaks when you need them. And finally, I want to say stay positive. A positive attitude can really help you stay motivated and focused on the task at hand. Knowing that it will be fine in the end makes the whole difference. And if you want to talk more about this, you know where to find me. And by the way, you've got this.